Hello, welcome back everyone to episode 40. Coincidentally, how old Noble is. Happy birthday, Noble. Happy 40th birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday, Noble. <laughs> Happy birthday. Thank you, thank you. Um, <laughs> it is our... Well, shit, Turo's got the Infinity Gauntlet. <laughs> <laughs> it is it's our... my armor, of course. That's what it is. <laughs> It's a spooky Halloween episode, the second one. Um, and this time, not everyone's gone crazy with the cosplay. Um, we'll go, well, I don't know, we'll go Verona first. Because I just, <laughs> look at Verona. This is Verona too spooky. He's got everything. Ready. He's, got a, he's got a gun. Wow. Shit. Oh, man. Oh, no. I was going around. Uh, and then we've got Captain William. He's got a gun and yep. a sword. You got a gun and a sword. And a no senior discount. <laughs> I don't know what it's called. <laughs> I would, I would like that as like an action movie slogan. Hey, William, that's better. Gun, sword, and no well, senior discount. Is, how am I gonna put this in and hear you? Oh, holy! That's shit. a major problem that we've had. Yeah. Well, before we get onto the mess that is noble, um, we we've got. Oh, this is a problem. Ragnar Briggs. <laughs> we got Ragnar Briggs oh, as this is a problem. As a bear. What up, boys? I'm Ragnar. I'm a bear. He is, in um, fact, a bear. It, ignore the fact that it is the pedo bear. Um, yeah. From, um, from old... From old times. Old internet oh, yeah. times. Old internet times. Oh, yeah. It's now been rebranded as just Ragnar. And he's got an eye sure. patch on. Um, it might be on the wrong eye. People are saying it's mm. the wrong eye. <laughs> You've got it on the wrong side. I do have the wrong side. <laughs> 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 um... And then, yeah, we got Duros. <laughs> Hello, Fred. <laughs> it's me, helmet. Duros. Oh, very good. And I'm, um, <laughs> I'm Straw Hat Luffy, because, or Goldie Roger, actually, or um, Shanks, Shanks, or yep. the original user of the Straw Hat, <gasps> Daniel Rustage. You... Yeah, <laughs> Daniel Rustage was Joy Boy this whole time. Yeah, don't, just... don't you know? Uh, and that's the scariest thing of them all. The realization that the entire One Piece franchise is originated from Daniel Rustage. Weird. <laughs> Before you were even born. Before crazy. I was even born. Yeah. Um, Wait, 97? 98 you're, you're, is you're... my... Okay, yeah. Before you were even born. That's yeah. incredible. Yeah. There you go. Well, I've, been, I've been alive for as long as One Piece has been alive. Um, that's nuts. Coincidentally, so have I, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Um. The, the yeah, the D. That's what the D means. It stands for Daniel. Yeah, there you go. That's what the will oh of D God. is. Daniel, guys, we cracked the code. Oda yes. reveals that, he and he's just like, yeah, it was <laughs> Daniel Rusters the whole time. He's like, man, this it's a <laughs> nerdcore rapper YouTuber. I there just, you go. No I, one will expect that coming. Oda's like, I just really liked his Luffy rap, so I had to. <laughs> man. I, I didn't Everybody have a plan. Everybody already guessed what the One Piece was, so it, it's it's just rusted. I just, I'm yeah, just picking I just something. Really fucking right. love that song. Yeah. Um, I really also like his album Overflow, which is out now in all stores. Yep. Um, oh shit. <laughs> uh, you can use code Briggs for no percent off. <laughs> Whoa, let's go! No percent it off, but it will quench your thirst. Are you guys ready to jump into this episode? Um, where you guys aye, were aye. last left off. Oh my god, Doris, you look so defeated. Me? Yeah, <laughs> you tried. Um, tried. Where you guys? Sorry, no, I still, I still have a sword. You know, I still All have. Right, you're good. You got you benevolence. Still still, you're good. I still have the infinity gauntlet. So I mean, that's, that's fine. fine. Yeah. I'm good. You know, let's go. I got I armor. Can't see, it's technically gold. <laughs> go. I was gonna say, are those are those welding goggles? Or are you like, is everything tinted? Everything yeah, is uh, fogged up. That's the problem. <laughs> okay, that's okay. Well, we can also see, see sort nothing. of the reflection in your goggles, which is very fun. Yeah. Oh yeah. hell yeah! You could look at my. Can you look at my face? I can see the reflection. We got that infinite. Oh wow! Uh, oh kind wow! Of. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah. You're there. All right. Sorry. This is very. I know this is also an audio podcast. So anyone listening on Spotify, <laughs> this is like, what the hell's going Just on? Just imagine right now. a reflection when of my looking into his soul, looking into my soul from Verona. And I also I realize this. That everyone's in costume, and I realize if you're listening to this on Spotify, you just have to imagine everyone in costume. Um, Apologize. We just have to preface everything we say with like teching dressed as William just decides to <laughs> jump over the crate. You know? <laughs> okay. What happened at the end of the last session was um, 
wall of corpses. The All Mother lost control of this like power that she has that she's kind of been essentially experimented on all her life uh, to hone this power and and now she's lost control of it. Um, and especially faced with the realization that everything she's been doing her entire life uh, was all in the service of two men who um, just wanted to achieve immortality for themselves and their greedy goals. Anyway, it sucks. She's had an awful life. Um, so she was started screaming. And then all of the corpses that are in this building, you know, the, all the ones that have been like human sacrificed, whatever, they all start moving. You've got this giant wall of shambling corpses that are coming towards you as a group. And we're going to use that as like the All Mother's turn. So the sea monster's still up. I've combined the sea monsters into one turn to simplify things. Um, what's going to happen now is it's Cyril's turn, is the first turn. And oh, obviously, roll for fear. Roll for I mean, if any pants. time Cyril's going <laughs> to roll for fear, it's going to be when there's a huge wall of shambling corpses. Um, it, okay. Just really quick, is it just the wall behind her that this like thing broke out of? Oh, or is it like every wall of this chamber? It's just, uh, it's kind of the walls behind her at the moment. Okay, because that's right in front of me and Pearl. Yeah, it's <laughs> right in front of me. The, the huge of thing is shit. in front of William and Pearl. It's like right in front of you guys. Oh Cyril my God. sees it and Cyril um, immediately starts pissing himself. Um, <laughs> yep, that's about right. Um, Cyril's going to make a, uh, Cyril's going to ah! scream. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Oh, no! calm down! Holy that was shit! Not the time for fear. <laughs> he we all our pants at that point. Hold up, guys! He critically succeeded oh! his wisdom oh, saving throw. Oh damn! Cyril, so he's held his like, shit together. <laughs> he's, he he starts screaming and then he's like, "Wait a second! Now is not the time for me to be scared. Now is the time for me to stand up and be a man." <laughs> he just instantly goes through puberty, like yeah. right there. Yeah, he starts he just, like, like growing <laughs> chest hair. And his his like jawline starts eye. chiseling out, and he starts getting muscles, and he's like, Duros, it is my time. Well, I'm, I don't know what to say, but I'm proud. He's evolved, <laughs> finally. <laughs> and he's like, he turns to Duros, and just because he got this crit on this, he goes, I've learned something from you. And he's going to use Action Surge. Yeah! <laughs> oh, damn! And he's going to Apple Pump that. twice. Well, he has it for this attack. Uh... He doesn't hit the first one, but he does hit the second one. And it, it sort of just splashes onto the onto the shambling pile of corpses. It doesn't really look like it's done much to it, but, you know, he's still very proud of himself as he's standing there. There's, like, wind yeah. flowing through his hair, even though you're indoors. Um, and he's s smiling, all his teeth shining <laughs> white. You can hear really, like, faint heroic music playing in the background. Um... <laughs> It's <laughs> apparently and that Duros is scared. Louis. 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 <laughs> Louis is right next to him still. So yeah, yeah. <laughs> Louis, can we get a French rendition of the Avenger theme? Thank yeah. you very much. <laughs> wait, wait, I do not know what the Avengers is, but I... From, oh, yeah. From oh. what? <laughs> from what, William? From that popular Grand Line, you know, newspaper comic book strip, oh, The Avengers. <laughs> ah, the one with, um, uh, Sea Stone Man? <laughs> Yes, him. And, the uh, ultimate scourge of pirates. Not as popular as Sora, the Knight of the Sea, but it's still pretty up there. We, you know? uh, okay. Da, 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 da. That's the Indiana Jones theme. That's the Indiana which, Jones yeah, theme. Indiana which, Jones the theme. Indiana Jones theme canonically is the theme of the Avengers in the One Piece yes, world. Anyway, it Verona, it's yes. your turn. Oh my God. All right. <laughs> Uh, let's see if I can find myself. Okay, so I walked forward before to talk no jutsu, so I'm kind of in the middle of everything. So I'm going to move just to the side a little bit to the yes. right. Yes, so yes. I have, I'm going to take three shots since I have triple attack now at this oh big God, gigantic blob. <laughs> bang, bang, bang. And uh, <laughs> let's see if I can. All right. Boom, boom, boom. All I don't know. Three hit. Hell yeah. Okay. Eight, seven, eleven. All right. Nice. Get the way. Eight. Popping heads on the zombies. Popping heads on the zombies. I mean, your bullets just like your bullets almost seem to get lost in this shambling mass of corpses. Fires the blob. Off. The blob. The blob of corpses. Dear God. Um. Anything else you want to do, Verona? Uh, that's all I got for this turn. So you got okay, Ragnar. Bad boy. Do I need to do any roll? 
For fear? No. Actually, no. I'm, I'm a barbarian at you're, this point. I think you're, like, you're, I you're, even... you're immune to fear. Let's go. You guys are fine. You guys, have, it's Cyril who's the little piss baby. Okay. Cool. You guys Not are anymore. hardened veterans. You guys don't need to roll for fear for this thing. I ain't yeah. scared. I'm a bear. <laughs> I've seen a lot of dead bodies. <laughs> yeah, you guys. Yeah. <laughs> Some left by Verona. <laughs> yeah, I mean, honestly speaking, I mean, this is just another Tuesday for us. Yes, really. Yeah. I think collectively we've all killed more corpses than this giant shambling mass right now. I mean, honestly. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna run up okay. on all four of my limbs because I'm a bear. Yep. For our audio listeners, I got you. I'm dressed up, <laughs> and I am actually gonna non-lethally. Attack the All Mother. The, the All Mother. What? Thank you. Ragnar, right. no. That's what, what you... I was going to do. <laughs> non lethally oh, no. because out of nowhere, Ragnar has realized she's hot. <laughs> what? Oh, <no. laughs> <Her out. laughs> this, is, this is legitimately a thing, right? I, I, I don't think any of these guys cared about the All Mother's safety, oh. but once they saw the art of the All Mother, when I no, said no, them on Twitter, yeah. we made a good yeah. idea not Almost to kill her now. All of yeah. them were like, I suddenly don't want to kill her anymore. Yeah, that was no, a good idea. No, Duros didn't want to I kill mean, her either. Duros, Duros always doesn't want to kill. Um, yeah. Now, Duros, wow. I remember last session, you're like, we should totally just stab her. I remember you saying that. I yeah. didn't say that. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my God. God. I'm right. Am I not riding Ragnar right now? I'm like, no, Ragnar, wrong <laughs> oh. Yeah, you are. Yeah. Yes. You are on top of me. Yeah. Wow. You're gonna you're gonna watch me slice at this girl. <laughs> Ragnar, what are you doing? Uh, you hit. Oh wait. Yeah, I mean you hit. I mean, she's not. not... Lethal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. not a combat right now. I don't, yeah, 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 I don't yeah. Think... Well, as in like she's not trying to. You do hit. You do hit. Well, she's okay. Yeah. yeah. Well, non-lethally, gonna do this damage. Sweet. Uh, that doesn't actually quite knock her out, but you're mm. getting you're getting her down. Uh, you're sort of s cutting into her. Um, He's probably just using the side of his axe and bashing her across mm -hmm, the face. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna say her armor class her armor class mostly stemmed from her dexterity, which is like kind of avoiding attacks, and because she's not avoiding attacks at the moment, mm. I'm gonna say that All her right. armor class is lowered. Just because cool. you know, I, fuck well, it. I th I just want to say that the attack I use is called the Kuma Bonk. The Kuma Bonk? <laughs> you start Kuma smashing bonk. her on, oh, yeah. the, on the top of the it's head? What I, it's when I use the flat side of the axe and not like the blade side. It's bonk, bonk. Bonk. That old, oh, that's cute. Yeah. And she's, <laughs> Yeah, her fucking head. You're smacking her around, but it almost feels like she doesn't even notice. Even mm -hmm. though you could see it's doing damage to her, she's still like in this panic state. Her hair's sort of flowing like crazy. She like tears streaming down where well, she still has the blindfold on that's flapping around um it so is for those of you at home she's having a psychological episode and a giant bear is just smacking her around with an axe yeah, yeah there we go. that seems like the logical thing to do no, no, Peter Wells, yeah. mm. so do you want to do anything else reggie <laughs> reggie <laughs> sorry that's all that's all <laughs> all right i don't know why i ate a gummy bear um bad idea for my pop it is now oh, pearl's turn me. Pearl sees this shambling mess of corpses and uh, flies back to a little bit of a safer distance. Um, okay. And All then right. she gets out a finger. Okay. Does some Naruto hand signs. Holy shit. <laughs> Chum, chum, chum. And... Pearl, what are you doing? This is no time to be playing Cat's Cradle. This is really dangerous. <laughs> and I know you've been practicing your, like, you know, twine thing. I don't know. Okay, and then she fires off a, um, like a, a little blast of fire. Essentially like a fire bolt out of her mouth. Okay. Um... And let's get that going. Oh, wow. Wow, that. Wow. That is wrong that, for the uh, that modifier. Was a bolt, that was a bolt of fire. <laughs> I don't know. That how that bolt of fire. It definitely doesn't have a plus 17. Her, I, she has when a, could you do this? <laughs> she has a plus oh seven. God. I just typed it in wrong when I put when I set it up. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Did you just learn sorcery? What was that? It, that, that it, it would it would be it would be a twenty-one still. 
still. Oh, okay. Oh, it still yeah. would hit for 14. Okay. As it All hits right. the corpses for 14. Like um, the corpses on fire. It is now the corpse's turn. Oh, oh no, shit. No. Now, I'm the... standing right in front of this fucking yeah. thing. The corpse oh, God. just moves. It moves slowly, about 30 feet. I mean, it moves like any other thing. And uh, what happens oh, God. is whatever the, the the corpses move over, it makes an attack on. But what All you right. do notice is that the corpses are sort of it, there's almost like there's a, like an invisible barrier around the All Mother as the corpses just part around her like Moses parting the Red Sea. But okay. the the corpses will make an attack on William and Ragnar. Just I, I by can't like, over like quickly if, like back up out of the way or anything. Yeah. That's a question though, Rustage. Yes. Am I still on him? So yeah, we ended last session. You were still on my back. I'm pretty sure. Oh yeah. Wait. So are you continue? All right. So when Ragnar moved, are you? Did Duros you decide to go with him? That is, that yeah, is Duros' I, choice. I mean, yeah, at this point, I'd be with my boy. All right, so he's going to hit all of you. Oh. Yeah. All right. I'll, I'll take it. I'll take it. Um, I still have to roll to hit, though. So, you know. I don't get to dodge this with, like, my evasion or anything. You well, know? From my perspective, do all of them just save. Like, sucked into this thing? Well, we'll, yeah. we'll, we'll yeah, see. Fine. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see, Verona. So, 20, oh, no. so William, 29... Ragnar 29 and Duras 18. Well, it doesn't hurt me, but I can use protect, um, I guess for my boy Ragnar. Oh, so you're gonna, so you're gonna take Ragnar's hit? Well, I mean, no, I, don't I have shield or uh, friend to impose disadvantage? Oh, impose disadvantage. Oh, you're right. You're right. Yes. No, my bad. I thought you were doing something else. So, uh, Ragnar, uh, do you want to roll your d4 then, uh, well, Duras? Well, okay, sure. Yes. Uh, let's see if it actually works. One d four. Okay, uh, I forgot to have the toggle on for. Royal d four. Oh, let's go. That's good for you. Okay. That's good. Yeah. So uh, that reduces the uh, nineteen down to fifteen. Does that hit you right now? Uh, my armor class is fifteen. Is it, so is it's it fifteen. It still it hits is. him. Damn it. Uh, okay. Well. I have. Can I redirect it back to me? Does that <laughs> How does that work? Like, like, you just like, work like you that. use your reaction to do either one of the abilities. Yes. I'm pretty sure. So yeah, I don't think you, that works. Yeah. So, I I have uncanny dodge, so when an attacker hits me, I can just take attack half damage. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So William, so I tried. William, you take half of forty-seven. Twenty-four. And Ragnar, you're actually also going to take half of this damage because of your barbarian okay. abilities, which yep. is. Half of 52. 26. 26. Oh, so, shit. <laughs> I get an attack off here because... He geez. missed. Okay. No, he still hit. He As in, uh, he missed Duras. But it missed me. So yeah. you no, but it doesn't matter. It, 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 it hit William, and he's close to right next to me. Yes. Right. What is going on? You're <laughs> 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 Me. My ability is not only for Duros, it's anyone within five feet of me. Yes. Uh, William is within ten feet of you. Oh, we're right next to each other. Okay. okay. It's, th it's still made an attack against Duros, though, so you could still Yeah, so you're still able to attack. Does it, it doesn't oh, matter. Okay. It attack me. Oh, okay. Uh, let me just retell it's When a creature is within five feet of you, make an attack against a target other than you. And oh. the creature is literally you know all what? around me. Then fair enough. But you still only have one reaction, so you're still just yes, making one attack. True. Yes, right, Just go ahead. There we go. Uh, you hit. Twelve hits. Good. Bam. Good. There you go. Take the damage. Does the damage. This, this thing's easy to hit. I mean, it's just corpses. Just yeah, a giant wall of corpses. It's a, wall it's a giant sources. wall of corpses. It's not too tricky to hit a giant wall of corpses. A blob. Um, but Ragnar and William, I need you guys to make strength saving throws for me. That's the okay. important thing. Oh, that's always fun. Ragnar, no. Am strong. Oh. We both Ragnar, got the same. I think you have advantage on strength saves, right, Ragnar? You should have advantage. You are a bear. Yeah. yeah. And you're raging. Mm. So that do sound, another. That, that sounds. That sounds right to me. Do another, another normal save, Ragnar. Just do another one. Yeah, another normal. Oh, oh never wow. mind. That's okay, okay. Really yeah, so we go for so sixteen. Yeah, seventeen really is the bad. DC. I will say this now, uh, which is very funny. Uh, Ragnar, seventeen was the DC. Yeah, Ragnar and William. As this shambling mass of corpses overwhelms you, you guys get oh. absorbed in and like swallowed up in the corpses. Wait, my mount. Uh, yes, no, my Dose, mount. <laughs> your your mount gets stripped oh. from you. As you manage no. to like block the corpses, what happens to you, Duros, is you get pushed back 30 feet. So you get pushed back next to Verona. Um, oh. 
Duros, what the fuck just happened? <laughs> <laughs> William and Ragnar got swallowed by the corpses. Oh god, no, this is worse than uh, the snake! Uh, <laughs> the the, Wait, sea, the monster sea monster also gets swallowed. Because the oh, sea monster oh, is sea sort of part of here. Yeah, the sea monsters are still there, and the sea monsters is kind of part of all mother's sort of thing. So the sea monster kind of winningly gets swallowed, and now there's a sea monster as part of this shambling horde thing. Um, so well, do we turn right. zombies too, or are we just like no? You're stuck not zombies. Mass. You're stuck right. in the mass, and you'll be taking damage uh, every round. Uh, I will need you to make another strength save to try and break out, but you will be taking a damage at the start of your turn for each What's up, round. What's Ragnar? You How you doing, man? <laughs> Oh. <laughs> I can't believe I rolled an 11 with a plus 9. I have no idea what, those nine, I have no idea what you just Twice. said, but yeah, me too. That is, that is, the, I mean, that's just one off having a critical fail. Yeah. yeah. I look that's over at one funny. of the zombies next to me and I'm just like, hey, how you doing? What's your story? Hey, my name's Ted. <laughs> oh, yeah. What's up, Ted? I'm yeah. William. I was, You've um, been in the mass long? Yeah, I mean, I was on a ship that got sunk because some dude shot it. Um, oh man, sounds like a dick. <laughs> I, I don't know who he is. Yeah. Yeah, it was awful. But they they, yeah. <laughs> they fished out my body and brought me here. Ah, well, well. Now, you're hopefully not... you can. <laughs> I tried to help you people. <laughs> Ungrateful pricks. <laughs> it all comes full circle, Verona. It all comes full circle. You people could have been burned alive, and nobody thanks me. <laughs> <laughs> More existential problem. They're all conscious and aware of their surroundings. Apparently. Now you're hallucinating that, William. I, I think they're oh, okay, just shambling okay, good, corpses. Good. <laughs> I'm just delirious from corpse juice. Okay. But it is now your turn, William. So the first right. thing that's going to happen on your turn is you're going to take damage. Oh, lovely. Um, all right. How to much? the tune of 66, you take 17. I was gonna say 66. Yeah, that's not even that. No, 66, no. <laughs> yeah, because that would leave me a one hit point. Yeah. I'm like, holy shit. All right, All I'm right, good. now make a strength save for me, William. All righty, don't fail. You ah succeed. Um, so <laughs> you, you, you kind of get pushed out of the shambling mass of corpses. Oh, William, welcome back. Oh God, that was worse than the snake. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> All right. I will I'm let back. you take an action though, if you still want to. All right. Uh, the All Mother is now inside of the. Uh, yeah, kind of surrounded. You can still see her, but she's kind of surrounded by the sea of um, uh, corpses. All right, I'm just, uh, I'm just gonna take a hack and slash with True Eight of Spades right at the corpses. Like Keep you know, going. just kind of. She's parting the seas. I'll part the seeds too. Okay. <laughs> I, all right. I jump up and I just like go to stab, stab. Uh, you hit. Twenty six. All right. Good job, Frank. It there we go. You don't actually get sneak attack. Oh, no, you're a swashbuckler. You do get sneak attack. I'm a swashbuckler, yeah. yeah. Just get swashbucklers yeah. pretty much get sneak attack on every hit. All right, you do yep. hit the damage. Um, I apologize for my eating. I should not be eating. One, one piece, you're fine. Get out of here, you stupid gummy bears. Um, oh, you slash. Sharing? You Never. Guys, my friends. You guys want some? You guys want some gummy bears? Yeah, sure. Bears? Give I love gummy bears. Right, Thank let me, you. Let Happy me Halloween. Yeah. Happy Halloween, oh, guys. Trick or treat. Here's, here's a gummy Thank bear. Thank you. Oh. Uh, yeah. I, I actually have gummy eat bears eat on my shelf over here, so I can just. I will not eat a fellow bear. <laughs> you will not eat a fellow bear? That's fair. <laughs> You're not a cannibal. Yeah. I'm not a bearnable. <laughs> bearnable. <laughs> oh, my God. All right, but anyway, yeah, I slash a shit ton of zombies. Yeah, yeah and you, you mean you cut through the zombies. It's not like you think what you're doing is ineffective. It's just not very effective. A lot of zombies. A lot yeah. of zombies is a big mess, big shambling horde. All right, Louis, what, what are you going to do? Uh, that's me, I'm Louis. Uh, Louis's kind of a dud at the moment because he doesn't have any of his abilities. He just kind of yeah. has his sword and gun sword. Um... After this is all over, guys, Captain's orders, we are getting nine hours of sleep after this. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to get I a full night of sleep after this. Uh, oh, yeah. uh, taking your sword still on fire. Is it? Yeah. Okay, so it does fire damage. All right, I didn't know if that was just a one attack thing or roll, if that was all the time. Roll the extra fire damage. All right, what's the fire damage again? 2d6. 2d6. Yeah, six extra six. damage. <laughs> all right, that's something. Hell yeah, trying to light zombies on fire. Yeah. Um, Louis Leclerc looks up at the zombies and goes, ah, sacre bleu. Um, Captain, what shall I do? I do not want to get close to that thing. Uh, you don't have any, we need to get you a projectile weapon, Louis. Something, <laughs> you know. I, I don't know. My aim just... is terrible. Yeah. 
Well, I, I don't... you do have a gun, so I'll just shoot anywhere and maybe it'll... <laughs> what, what, is, what is the current status on Trevor, Rustage? What, yeah. Is he still, uh, like... Trevor's wounded, um, but okay. he's alive, and he's coming All up right. next in the turn order. Tell you what, Louis, go help Trevor. Do do just help him out. I don't know, would, man. I would okay. He runs up to Trevor and he puts a hand on Trevor's shoulder and goes, <laughs> Trevor, I always thought you were very strong and very handsome and very courageous. <laughs> You... Wouldn't that give Trevor advantage if he helps yes. him? Like, let's yeah, do this that. is the help right. action. It's going to give him yeah, advantage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Help, yeah, you help, help action. action. Yeah. You can yeah. do whatever you put your mind to. You know that? Um, just, just we adore you. Trevor just looks at him like, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> um, he, he, take, he looks right? directly into Louis Leclerc's eyes and says, you smell like garlic and piss. <laughs> no, it's. <laughs> but that gives him the inspiration he needs. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and then Trevor looks up at the shambling mound and goes, William! Yes! Just fucking kill the bitch! I mean, she seems to be having a rough day. She's clearly the one controlling this horde. We're having a rougher day. Just well, kill her! I can't get to her until I cut through the mass of corpses, Trevor! <laughs> yeah. You're the same fucking guy that did that crazy flippin- Just flippin' shit! I can't- I'm on the other side of the room! I will- <laughs> He's gonna- Trevor's gonna run up, but he can't quite make it all the way. Um... How about you run up and then throw your sword? That'd be cool. You could probably do that. Uh, what? That's actually my sword. <laughs> no. <laughs> Alright. He's gonna run up. <laughs> Trevor's gonna run up. Um, he can't quite make it to the All-Mother. Um, I wouldn't get so fun, close because it's going to move up. Yeah, <laughs> I would not get so close. Uh, shit, I, I didn't. I, I didn't do a. Uh, uh, yes. I'm, I'm not scared of this thing, Duras. He then like. All right. <laughs> listen, you you guys didn't go through the same sort of training I did in the navy. You know that. Literally in a, swallowed our big bear friend. I, I mean, Cyril did. Yes. Yeah. Watch this. Place. But 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 Duras, <laughs> I, I don't know if you quite remember, but I kind of. One shot your big bear friend, uh, so yeah, but that well, was like true. that was like a while ago. Feel I think any yeah. of us could take you on now, personally. You think so? Um, yeah. You know what? You, you know, know what, William? Now is you know not what, the time for you that. Know what, so... William, after this is all done, how about we have a nice one-on-one -on -one little fight? Tell you what, we'll you see. and me, big bro, you and me. I slap my hand on his shoulder. I'll use oh. this sword. I'll use the sword I took from you. We'll fight together. Yeah, don't no, worry. you can. I I would do it without any swords. That is how confident I am that I can whoop your little ass. Okay, buddy. Oh no. <laughs> there is a little <laughs> blob of you know, we're not even really brothers, but we now it feels like we're little brothers. Blob of corpses. I'm kind of over. I'm down to fight too. Let's do it. <laughs> 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 We're just having a sibling rivalry moment as this yeah. shit, this giant mass of corpses. <laughs> Duras, it's your turn. Oh goody! <laughs> oh goody! Um, well, it's seeing how's this wall of corpses literally right in front of me. I'm going to try and hack at it to see if I can free my friend Ragnar from its, you know, kill enough to maybe try and get him out. Um. <laughs> So, uh, I guess here we go. Let's get the benevolence out here. Right ho, and. <laughs> hot. You hit it. Hot. Hot. You hit it. Hot. You hit it. <laughs> All right. And there we go. Um, have another one, I suppose. And uh, one more. <laughs> I imagine Juro's like stopping. Oh, I guess you could have another one. <laughs> I suppose another. All right. And I recover seven HP, so that's great. Yeah, perfect. Um, and as my bonus action, I will try to use a shield bash to knock a few zombies back a little bit, so I can push it back a little bit. All right. You, you. I'm not going to do any rolls for this. You smash it with your shield, but it, it is an immovable object. It is. I mean, you hit some of the zombies might get hit back, but then they just get replaced with other zombies. In this, well, that's important. It's almost like a tidal <laughs> wave of zombies. Um, then I will also uh, step back a little bit. <laughs> <as well>. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. I don't know how far it traveled the first time. Are you, did you guys? I will try and travel back. I a mean, bit. It, about about as much as it took to glomp me and Ragnar. So yeah, stay back. 
Was that like 15 feet or something? Yeah. Uh, Maybe leave. something, perhaps. So, all right, I'll move back 15 feet. For anyone all right, Duros, let's say the squares in front of us are five foot increments. Let's just assume. <laughs> <laughs> it's like about uh, you can move back. You can move like, yeah, the remainder of your movement. But I, I do want to say this to everyone. Uh, this thing does not uh, evoke opportunity attacks because it doesn't actually make attacks. It just attacks anything that it uh, comes over. So yeah. uh, Duros moving away from it will not invoke an opportunity attack so oh interesting you're free to do okay. so and that's what you discover by doing so and that's what i did yes <laughs> <laughs> all right well put yourself back 50 feet or so from i where... don't know how 15 feet works but okay there that's you go that's, that's about good it. enough um yeah. okay it is healy's turn it is a robot wait no i'm pretty sure it's a zombie healy um <laughs> <laughs> my my like... fucking brain just did it died. Uh, Healy Healy puts away the mirror he's looking into. Sorry, I, it is a zombie. <laughs> Legitimately, I thought I'd said zombie, but like I thought it. <laughs> Robots are zo robot zombie. That should be a new movie. There we go. Okay. Oh god. <laughs> um. Oh my god. All right. Yeah, we need to give Healy a fucking just a gun at some point. Like, I don't even care. Like, it doesn't even matter. Just like well, something. I, I, to I have, imagine you know? that. Well, some of you are probably going to require his aid at one point. Uh, yeah. Well, Healy only has one heal left. Yeah, so. and I mean like, you know, who's close to him? I mean, Pearl, mm -hmm. Louis, and Sue are the only people in. They don't really range. have. They're they're doing okay. They're doing yeah. okay. So we want to save his remaining heal. Yeah. Or... yeah. Just move up a little by me, Mister Healy. I'll keep you nice and safe. Okay. Yeah, okay. I will come next to you, do Rose. Just, just behind me, not, not <laughs> just behind me. He, he can't get all the way. Yeah, right, you, right. But he gets closer to you. Um, it is now the All Mother's turn, but the All Mother is still just screaming, and nothing is really happening here. Um, but you do notice, you do hear more screams coming from outside oh. the door. Oh no! Oh shit! Uh, yeah, we're like, kind of attracting ah, a lot of attention in ah, here. Ah, ah, <laughs> No! My leg! That's what you hear. All right. It's back to... <laughs> the... Okay. You notice that the actual Sea Kings themselves are still sort of like twirling in a sort of dazed state. It's Cyril's turn again. Cyril like rips off his shirt. His like oh. muscles gleaming. <laughs> Man. <laughs> Just... What's going on there, boy? Crush them, Cyril. <laughs> You're a man now. He grew uh, a little bit of a beard between this round and yeah, last yeah, round. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like is, is that one Five speck of stubble. chest hair yeah. that I see on that bear chest? A little bit of chest hair. Don't That's say bear. Uh, uh. <laughs> um, he's going to use hydro cannon, <laughs> which is ah yes, I know which is just means. just like aqua pump, but just a little bit better. Hydro pump. I mean hydro cannon and aqua pump. Yeah, there you there go. There you go. Um, oh, oh, oh. All right, so he's gonna hydro cannon. Crit? Not a crit. Uh, no. he, he doesn't actually hit because he's got armor class of twelve. Ah, <laughs> oh, dang it! So he puts his arms together, like almost like a kamehameha, and he puts it out and blasts forth this giant wave of water that flies forwards. And right before it hits the shambling mound, it sort of dissipates and onto the yeah, floor. I'm like, you and, go, Cyril! And then all of a Damn sudden, it! Cyril looks around and his muscles sort of deflate and he's a bit like Spongebob <laughs> when he has those like fake muscles on. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. And he oh, sort God. of yeah, deflates arms. down. And he's, arms. he's like, oh, 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 I'm so sorry. I... <laughs> Damn it! All right, <laughs> just needed a little more effort. There, uh, next why? Time. Why am I shirtless? Where did my shirt go? <laughs> <laughs> I don't. I don't know what happened. I, guys, I felt like I blacked out for a while. Is that a zombie? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> no, no, Cyril, it's fine. You're doing it's good. A robot. We'll be okay. <laughs> uh, Verona, you're back. Your your turn. Right. So you said we can kind of see her through this thing, right? Yes, yes, yes. Am I able to attempt to take shots? Towards her, like with disadvantage. You can't unlethally you... kill her. You will lethally kill her. Listen, they are lethal. There's shots. a gigantic blob in front of us. I don't care if Ragnar thinks she's hot. I think we have to take her out. I, You're gonna, I will disagree. I mean, okay. I also agree she is hot. <laughs> 
<laughs> but what's your stance on that? Why are we okay. hot topic? All right. That should do let she is a just yes. poor innocent lady. She, I understand that she's innocent, but if we don't do something, we're going to die. So well, let's try suggest? knocking well, her out then. You're, you're not going to be shooting with disadvantage. You'll be. She'll have like partial cover. Is what mm. she'll have. So she'll have a oh, higher armor class. Mm. You know but, what, Verona? I have faith in you. I think we. I think everything will work out. Okay, what? take the I shot. Let's you know kill what? the <laughs> zombies. <laughs> Hang on. There's I a have, lot of I zombies. I have an idea. I'm going to take my remaining scimitar. Oh and God. Animate it. Okay. 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 Well, this, is my, this is my last devil fruit use that I have. Okay. I'm scared. The you just have these weapons on standby, Spooky. Just like okay. Listen, I went all out for this cosplay. Okay? Damn straight, you did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> for this year. For those Absolutely. who are listening. Yeah. Too spooky did pull out an actual scimitar. <laughs> yeah, I'm ready. Right. So, li li li. It's... <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you animate the scimitar, and you know, it grows eyes, it's like legs and arms, like normal, and it comes up and it goes, Oui, 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 bonjour. <laughs> My name is, um, <laughs> Scimitar Le Clock. <laughs> I am the distant cousin of that man over there. <laughs> And Louis's like, oh, is that Scimitar Le Clock? I mean, it is good to see you again, Scimitar Le Clock. It has been so long. <laughs> Scimitar Le Clock says, ah, my cousin. You are so many questions. I, I don't mean, even give a fuck. This is awesome. We'll have to talk about this family tree later. But for now, <laughs> oh, related to I'm going to send you to run through the blob and non-lethally stab this lady in the shin. <laughs> I could do me my best. Yeah, I was always the better brother. Yeah. Throw it out. <laughs> and then, so it does out. it make it through? Or uh, like what happens? Yeah, well, what happens is he like jumps on the tops of the heads of the corpses and starts running it. So that's like surfing. He's surfing the corpse wave until he makes his way to the uh, All Mother. Uh, <laughs> and then do you want to do... Yeah. <laughs> do you do want to do a... Uh, you don't hit the All Mother. Well, <laughs> well, get him next time, little we'll try guy. Try his best, damn it! <laughs> All right, well, I'm just gonna kind of like back up slightly then, if I can do that, to like where Duros is at, because I don't want to get swallowed. So yeah, that that's gonna be my turn, I suppose. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, all right. You move back. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, actually, just double check the other class real quick to see if that did hit or not. Uh... Uh, I'm so sorry. Mm. It did actually hit. Whoa, oh, hit. good. Okay. Never mind. Good job, little guy. All right. Here we go. <laughs> uh, where is this cursor, dude? All right. All right. Eleven. Straight into the, straight into the all mother's leg. Uh, blood dripping down. She's still alive though, but uh. You can, she's definitely getting more and more wounded, but the, sh the, the corpses start like shambling more aggressively in response to the attack. Um, Verona can still attack, but the reason why Verona's doing this is because you can't do non-lethal attacks with a uh, ranged weapon. Yeah, um, I don't want to get swallowed. <laughs> That's also a smart idea. I mean, you can, I mean, right. Trevor turns around and is like, what are you hesitating for, Verona? Kill her! Oh dear lord. Ragnar thinks she's hot. Yeah, I mean- It's pop, true! But, uh, <laughs> me, <laughs> we jokes value. aside, the crew what? wants her to survive. Yeah. And Afterwards, like, yeah, if we, we decide she needs to die, we can take Tell you what, we'll ourselves. knock her out, and if the zombie corpse mound is still here, then, well, we'll have to think about other options. But well, let's just do this first. All right. Uh, Ragnar, you're up. Uh, you're gonna take some damage straight away from being in the mount. Uh, you this take shit is unbearable. Oh! oh you take 24 oh damage. God. 40 episodes. That was the first time that was ever used. Well, that's kind of sad. <laughs> I, it's probably been used before. I, I don't remember. The 24 damage is not half, by the way. Um. Oh, I 24? I thought you said 4. No, 24. Oh, so I am back 24? to 62. I, that's like you're at a shop and you're like, that yeah. was, this is $50? I thought you said 5. <laughs> 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 um, ah, 38. My bad. You, yeah, all right. There you go. Um, now, do you want to do your strength saving throw? To see if you get out of this mound. Again, you have okay. advantage, Ragnar, so. I have advantage. I have a plus nine. You should be able to get out of this. And you do! Oh, you break out of it. Burst out of it. 
in your bear form. Got me. Yeah. All right. And I'll, I'll still let you have your actions if you want. Okay. Um. I imagine Ragnar cannot see the All Mother. Oh yeah, your perception's no. so bad. Yeah. There's just a blob of things yeah, in front of me. Your passive perception's so bad. Yeah. I'm just like, ah, oh, and I swing my axe three times at the corpses. Go ahead. I mean, you hit three times with your axes. There, I'll do it. You must spin. Wow. I mean, they all hit and they do a lot of damage. Um, but it just still seems like the corpses are still coming, and they're still. There we go. Put that all in. Still in. Whatever the word is. Inevitable. As Thanos used to say. Um, Ragnar, are you going to do anything else? That's it. All right. All right. Ragnar's still standing in front of the corpse mounds. You're not moving back, Ragnar! <laughs> yeah. Ragnar! We're actually I ain't really all bad at that, apparently. I ain't scared of no corpses. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh my gosh, okay. Look, I may be brave, but I'm not stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Ragnar does not step backwards. Oh, no. Only step. forwards. Yeah? I can't protect you from up there, friend. One yeah. time someone was trying to teach Ragnar how to swim, and they said, all right, now let's learn how to do a backstroke, and backstroke, and Ragnar was like, no! <laughs> Front stroke <laughs> only! Breast crawl, maybe, but never backstroke! <laughs> Not the backstroke. What how, is this? How fucking dare you? And then he killed him. Pearl's turn. <laughs> the, all right, then. Pearl's can, can continue to run back whilst firing off, like, these fire shots. Use the, use the fireball thing. Essentially, like Sasuke does. Um, of course. You know, from oh. One Piece. All right. Yes. I thought he was from Bleach. We all thought <laughs> she... And it hits. It does okay. damage. Nice. Decent. Enough. All right. It's now the corpse's turn. Oh, no. So this corpse is going to move over William, Ragnar, and Trevor. Oh, God. Oh, this shit again. No. Okay. All right. Now, this is unfortunate for you guys. So William, Ragnar, Trevor. I did it in that order. Uh, oh, William, man, 22. Thing. Ragnar, 27. Man. Trevor, 13. Trevor's fine. <laughs> yeah, I, I get hit. Yep. Uh, get hit. Way to go, Trevor. Good job. Trevor just gets pushed back instead. Um... Oh my god, that's some good rolls as well. I think William, that might mean you're... I like, uh, oh, you can uncanny dodge it, though. Hold up. I can. I can take half damage. So I've had a long day today, Trevor, okay? I would normally be able to dodge this thing. I haven't slept in a while, okay? Oh, they both add up to 56, which wow. is incredible. Wow. <laughs> so... Jesus. <laughs> what are okay. the likelihoods of that happening? Um, uh, I don't know, some number. Okay, William, are you going to halve it? And right yeah, now, you halve it, it anyway. So, I mean, yes. to be fair, out of any two people... To be in the front firing line. Yes, twenty-eight. They are the ones to be there, I guess. Yeah, twenty-eight. So you guys both take twenty-eight. You're both alone, Sheet. but you guys are still yeah. alive. Strength saving throws, gamers. Yep. You see, this was all part of my master plan. Ooh, wow, that's rough. I don't have any yeah. luck left either. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Oh, all right, you'll get sucked up again. Let's see if you are able to get down. Oh, yeah, God, okay, back to this again. Ragnar. William got a 13. Ragnar. This was all part of my master plan. I couldn't find the All Mother, so I let the corpses grab me. Yeah. <laughs> You're you I gotta right. lead you to the All Mother? <laughs> Fuck. 16 Fuck. also fails. I, oh, God. Well, oh, back into God. it, huh, Ragnar? God damn it. I thought it would <laughs> I can't work. believe it. So you guys get pulled back into the, to the, the corpse Hey, Ragnar, mountain. I have an idea. After next time we get out of here, let's just run away from this fucking thing. <laughs> all right, but that's not all. No. Um, Cyril, Louis Clock, which are not any of you guys. I'm just telling Cyril and Louis Leclerc. Um, the, okay. the, the, the golden doors that are behind you guys suddenly burst open. Okay. And a oh. mound of corpses comes crawling out. And oh. anyone, I mean, Duras and Verona. <laughs> corpses in this place. I mean, you guys you saw a bunch of the corpses in the catacombs. There was kids' corpses fucking everywhere. You guys can sort of see out into the main cathedral area, and it's just carnage out there. Cultists, dead bodies scattered across the ground. There's like fire going off. You, you know a bunch of those robot things? They've all been overrun by corpses, and they're just like, in disrepair, you see V Junior running around like, "Oh no! <laughs> oh God! They're coming after me!" And then he gets swallowed by some corpses. Um, and oh gosh, I mean, if Jam was still alive, 
he would probably not be anymore. Um, so is he a corpse? Is he in the he's pile? Leading this, the corpses that have burst into this room <laughs> is the Jeez. corpse of Jam. Oh, uh, shit. <laughs> oh, Jam, no! Okay. Uh, I think new plan, we should probably just burn this whole fucking place down after we leave. <laughs> you know? oh. oh, my lord. Uh... <laughs> All right. Well, this one exists. It's not moved in yet. Oh, my God. <laughs> getting flanked from both angles. It's like a corpse sandwich. All right. Uh, William, no. you're going to take some damage here. Yeah, I sure am. I just did. Uh, 19, which is so good because you've got like 22 health remaining. I have three hit points left. That's oh, amazing. Yeah. That doesn't kill you. It's all right, okay, guys. I'm all right. How are these things hurting me while I'm in? Am I just getting crushed or well, like stomach no, acid? They're like biting it, it, it is. Oh, it is. Oh, they're just biting me. No, no. It, it's a mixture of you being like crumpled, but then also there's like it is acid. It's like um, ew, necrotic, like ew, acid ew, burning ew. away at your skin. Ah. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, do you want to roll another shred saving throw, Mr. William? Oh God. Please don't be bad. No. Oh, yeah, son of a oh, bitch. And you're, you continue to be crushed. <laughs> this is right. it. Well, I had a good run. <laughs> yep. All right, so that's, just, that's just my turn that's then. That's just your turn. Mm, yep, okay then. I'm so sorry, William. No, no, it's fine, man. Can I use panache on the zombies? <laughs> Why not Shay on the top? Ted, you're looking pretty. God. I mean, for a desiccated corpse, you look pretty damn fly today, man. <laughs> <laughs> Had a new haircut. I'm like all delirious. Half my face is melting off. I'm like. <laughs> all right. Well, Louis Leclerc's turn. Louis Leclerc's like, ah, shit. Sacre bleu. I, this day just gets keeps getting worse. Um, where's the Captain Duras? That's third in command. <laughs> third? <laughs> no, second in command. What, what, what shall I do? There are more corpses. There's, we're surrounded by corpses. Duros we is are... second in command. He is Duros best is mate. second in command. Yeah, yeah, he is the We are least. surrounded by fucking everything. If you could somehow retrieve the captain, that'd be great, but I don't even think you could get near him. I can't. Oh. <laughs> I will run closer then. Um, I guess, yes. Um... Not too close, though, I guess. Trevor looks up at the corpse mound and the All Mother in, in the center of it. There is quite a distance now between, like, he's going to have to wade through these corpses, which is he won't be able to quite get to the All Mother in one turn. Um, but he's Brother. going to fucking try. Uh, but you you have your hand reached out, and Trevor, Trevor sees the All Mother with fury in his heart and then sees the hand of his brother. There's sort of a moment as he looks back and forth. And then he sighs to himself and he grabs William's hand. Um, the character arc is complete. <laughs> oh my uh, He's going to make a strength check here to pull out uh, William. Which he's pretty good at. Nope. Is that what I think How? it is? Oh, oh my How? god. It would be a 16. He, he gets sucked into <laughs> I didn't mean that. That, that would have uh, been like a crit fail thing, but no. Oh my god. Well, He's thinking about it. We're saying this is with advantage anyway, because he, even with Healy's help, it's, it's the 16. Yeah, no. So he grabs Trevor's hand and, sorry, grabs William's hand and starts trying yep. to pull and pull, and he can't quite get you out. But Come on, Trevor. Come on, buddy. 16 is very close where I will let you have advantage on the next roll, which is actually okay. pointless because you're just, you're going to die yeah, in your next die. turn anyway. <laughs> but yeah, <laughs> he's trying to pull you out. He's like, you son of a bitch. Uh, why? You're, you're, you're fat. That's what you are. You're it's fucking like, fat. I'm, you on, I'm on a diet. Come a on di now. You're going to be on a diet in a second. Oh, I get it because I'm going to die. Yeah, you're going <laughs> to. I'm very serious. I've lost a lot of blood right now. Uh, I'm like, okay. <laughs> I can't. I can't quite. I used to be sh stronger than this. Um, we've all we've all had a rough day, Trevor. I don't blame you, but you suck at the same time. <laughs> Haven't you ever pulled your brother out of a giant corpse mound before? Come on, man. <laughs> all right, Duros, it's your turn. All right. Oh boy. Um. Well, now is a good time as any. I can I use my commander strike to command Pearl to pick me up to take me to the All Mother. Uh, 
I think Commander Strike just makes someone do an attack. Doesn't make them do okay. anything, does it? Then I will uh, command Pearl to melee attack the All Mother to try and knock her out. But it's... if she can, she can fly in there. I don't oh, know. Oh, she does. She Sixty can. foot. Oh, 60 oh, foot fly speed. She's 75 feet away. Damn. Um, so this is the one time where it's good to have it like this, where she can she can't quite get to the old mother, um, but she can fly. Uh, she she will fly up though, above the mound. Um, I don't think she can move. Can she? I don't think. Wait, the commander strike. Read the commander strike. I don't think it lets her move. Uh, okay. When you take an attack on your turn, you can forgo one of your attacks and use your bonus attacks to direct one of your companions to strike. Yeah, I don't think you can uh, make her move. You can just make her attack. You can just make her attack. Well, damn. Um. Shit. Um. So I, I can't, yeah, I can't even command Trevor to try and pull out William again. Yeah, but you can command Trevor to attack the mound, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it, well, when in doubt, I mean, just go do doubt. what you gotta do. <laughs> all, right, all right, well, um, fuck, I guess Trevor, it's, uh, go ahead and try and strike out the mound to free your brother. Okay. Yeah. Um, like, it's just one yes. attack, right? Yeah, one attack, just one. Yeah, okay, justice. And then one d10 plus on top of whatever. Yeah, so it's roll a roll a d10. Nice. Yeah. I'll do it. So you slices into Trevor, full of inspiration, whilst trying to get uh, William out. Is slicing into the corpse mound. Uh, uh, fuck! <laughs> this has been honestly, William, the worst day of my life. I thought oh, the yeah, worst day of my <laughs> life was when I was chopped off that zeppelin by Jefferson. But honestly, you're, this is taking the fucking piss. Actually, I thought it, when our parents got I thought it might have been when our parents died. But at the moment, I'm about to lose another family member and to one. To be fair, this is at least the third worst day of my life. But you know, I wouldn't trade it for the world. You are a cunt. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. uh. I slap him in the face. I'm like, we don't use that word here. Not on my crew. Oh my gosh. Um, right. I guess it's Healy's turn. I, William, do you want no, me no, to I still, I can still attack. You can still, still attack. My bad, my bad, my bad. Yeah. Yeah. Um, then I will also just do some at least two extra attacks here yeah, if they hit. Yeah. Um, Did they both right. hit? Well, all right, there's something at least. Yeah. And, oh God, do I do it? Oh, do I do it? Do I just go in? I don't think we have much choice. This is all or nothing. Everyone's gonna die. I mean, devil's luck and all. <laughs> I'm not I, worried. I think I have <laughs> to do it. Floating around like, ah, don't worry. Everybody you're in else. the chat telling me like, just use your fruit. Um, it it has initiative before my turn is, and I'll probably just die then anyway, because you know, I I don't think I can use my fruit ability to get out. Yeah, I think I uh, might die off. I might yeah. die off the next turn damage. <laughs> yeah, you oh, I'm yeah, definitely might. going down. You might. Yeah. You'll go unconscious. You won't be dead. Yeah, I won't be dead. I'll be unconscious. Will, yeah, but that's I like will that's before. Go into I am. the the mass directly, and go next to Ragnar. I will, I will go in there. You wanna go? You can walk on top of it, I guess. You can climb it like a mountain. I, I will go in there. You're going inside. I will do. Yes, I will have to. I have to save Ragnar. All right. And maybe me. <laughs> All right, <laughs> Duras. Can maybe you, the. Duras, can you do a strength check to see if you can still move once you go inside? I suppose. Otherwise, you uh, will just get lost up. Is like it the is other it a two. save or is it just no? A this is a check. Be this is just a check. An athletics check or a strength check, because you are athletics or okay. Going into the zombie house. Twenty four. You're good. I'll do you, it. Yeah. All right. The, the push movement, through. Yeah, you push through. You wade through. The movement of the yes. zombies do not deter you, and you you manage to walk up next to Ragnar. You can't pull him out this turn, but you are you have him. All right. Ragnar, you see Durus waiting oh, wait, for the friend. zombies. I missed you guys so much. No one here has skin. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I like, I, I even, can I even get on top of him just so I can take the damage for him? <laughs> Why not? I know this While is weird. While he's being surrounded by zombies. I, I, I will try my best, damn it. Yeah, I'll say you can boy. mount him 
And yes. I know the rules probably say when they do it, but fuck it. I, I will let you take the damage for the one hit because I think thematically yes. it's very cool. If you like yes. mount Ragnar and kind of cover him all with your shield yes. protecting. So the next time Ragnar gets damaged, it will go to you instead. Yes. Wow. Uh, Duros. For my boy. I love you, Duro. <laughs> You idiot, you should have gotten out! <laughs> you fucking idiot! I never see the old mother. She's just over there. The old mother, who is just over there, is like oh, hyper aware of the shit that's going on. She's like looking around, tears streaming down her face. She's like, I'm sorry! <laughs> Kill me! She screeches out. <laughs> I don't, I can't control it! I don't know what's going on! I. <laughs> She's like on her knees, distraught, as the swarms of zombies move around her. It's Cyril's okay. turn. All right, Cyril. Cyril turns round, and I just want you guys to picture this. Everyone's fighting this huge mound of zombie corpses, but right behind Cyril, right after he unchattified, was a, another huge shamble in corpses. And he turns round, and like Attack on Titan, where Eren sees the Colossus Titan for the first time. Um, yeah. He turns round and just sees this massive wall of corpses and nothing Boom. between him and the corpses. <laughs> um, and he's like, oh, poops. Oh, uh, <laughs> he's going to run towards the center as any sane person would do. And yeah. as he's running back, he's just going to shoot off an aqua pump. Um, kind of as, as quick as he can. Oh. Okay. It's hits. All right. All right, Verona, it's your turn. <laughs> Seven damage. Let's go. Right. <laughs> I'm going to look at the giant mound in front of me. The doors behind me smash open. Another blob coming in. Look back at that and just kind of <sighs> side of myself. And I was going to monologue to Duros, but he's in the blob now, so I'm just going to speak to myself. But what? You still have your sword, too. Maybe. Yeah. But <laughs> if there's one thing I've learned through our travels, it's that not everybody can be saved, regardless of if they deserve to be or not. But before I do anything, I'm, you know, making sure I'm going to try to non-lethally strike her. Compared, at this but, point, I'm like almost gone. So, I'm just like, at this point, do what you got to do. <laughs> yeah. If this works, great. If it the doesn't damage. work. Uh, I mean, it doesn't actually knock her unconscious because she still has okay. a little then, bit. Probably maybe she should have shot. I'm sorry, like, guys. Uh, then you got to do what you got to do, man. That's a bonus action. That's a bonus action. Yeah. So. No. I actually have yeah. a special bullet that I have not used yet. So oh, I'll pop that in here. It's called the Seeking Arrow. So what I'm going to use that is my last one. And basically, uh, what it does is as long as I've seen somebody before, it can navigate around stuff to hit somebody directly. So uh, I'm sorry, boys. That means you right. can shoot any of us at any time. That's so good. <laughs> exactly. So oh, goody. I'm going to, you know, load it in. Do what you got to do, man. And I'm just going to whisper under my breath. I'm sorry. And click. And uh, we'll see what happens. I mean, it definitely hits. The seeking thing ignores all covers, right? I think so. I think, like, normally she would have to do a dexterity save, but I think because she's hysterical, she probably wouldn't, right? No, no, no. She's in essentially immobile. So, yeah, it hits. All right. Click. And that is enough to kill her. So, you fire off the gun after you say, I'm sorry. It's almost like the world goes in slow motion. It's the bullet threads through all the zombies. I mean, Ragnar and Doris, you see the bullet fly past your eyes. It goes, eyes. like, right by my eyes. Yeah, it goes know, past all of your have, eyes, like, in the corpses. really should have shot her first and then did the other thing. Well, well, well. <laughs> and then <laughs> it flies through. I don't know how much health she had. The, um, the, the All Mother sort of looks up at Verona, and you see her sort of, like, it almost looks like she's mouthing, like, thank you. And then the bullet penetrates her heart. Ugh. And sort of everything goes still for a second. And all of the corpses collapse to the ground. And you oh guys, my God. almost like you've been washed up on sea, are just lying in this sea of corpses. Um, uh. And the All Mother falls down to her on her knees, blood dripping down her mouth. She, she looks up and her blindfold falls off. And you see her eyes, tears welling up in her eyes. And she just whispers, I'm so sorry. I'm so 
so sorry. And then she falls over and collapses on the ground, dead. And as she collapses on the ground, out of her pocket, uh, like a little piece of paper sort of crumbles out onto the ground. Well, that's a shame. She was pretty hot. <laughs> you, you have a wife, Ragnar. I'm a faithful man. I, <laughs> I tend to. Sorry. You know, I can. I can appreciate a person's. Oh. I mean, I thought she was hot too, Love. but I mean, we were all kind of dying there. So, Verona, you, you had to do what you had to do. I yeah, wasn't sorry. Right. Risk your guys' yeah, lives. You, you did all save our lives, so I thank you for that. Only caused us harm. I um. I did my best. I guess I'm the closest to her. Uh, me and Ragnar, I, I, I pick up the thing that she dropped. Well, you look at like, the piece of paper, and it's a, it's a drawing of her, uh, like her looking at like a young version of her. It's uh -huh. it's, it's quite a nice little drawing, um, and it, oh. it says to Raindrop from Hastings. Oh, that looks sentimental. Yeah. I just kind of drop it on the ground. <laughs> what? I really just want to be like, I crumple it up and throw it off the side. But I'm not that mean. I just like, all right. I set it down next to her because that looks like a personal thing that like, you know, yeah. somebody what? else wants to take it. They can. I'll just set it down next to her. Yeah. And Trevor's like, fucking finally. Jesus Christ. Oh, <laughs> God. Oh, um, God. But yeah, all the corpses have collapsed now and you can see in the wake of the devastation, um, that out in the cathedral, like almost all of the cultists uh, died in that oh, chaos. They had like a little mini zombie apocalypse in there. Um, wow, there's a lot of blood. Yeah, uh. that the, the you see the sh like a shambling body of of V Junior come into the room. He's like missing his legs. He's just toppled oh. off of his body, and he looks up at you guys and goes, "What happened?" Somebody tell me. I I honestly what? couldn't tell you. Like, <laughs> I have no idea what this shit's going on right now. Uh, and he sort of... Falls Verona, down. I'll let you handle this one. <laughs> that is this is more your guy. speed. Just walk up to him and just kind of, like, crouch down and look at him. We put an end to your charade. No. We were so close. Uh, my father this is a genius. <laughs> God, you're gonna have to hold me back. <laughs> I'm, I'm too well, like, weak, I, man. I think I'm he's half already dissolved. quite dead by himself. Yeah. He looks like he's dead. <laughs> Here, I, I just kind of motion for my scimitar to run back over to me. Yeah. So, I don't know if you want to voice act it. Yeah. Just... Yeah. I am the, I am the scimitar. Uh, this we, I am very happy that things have gone back. We, this is good. So uh, I'm Great. just gonna have it like motion itself like right underneath his throat with the blade, and Kill just him. kind of look at him and. Oh, not yet. I'm gonna uh, ask him a question. So, uh, what exactly makes your father such a genius, huh? What? He's so many inventions. He's an incredible man. Um. I understood why he had to lay, leave. Arzen, he's the real madman. I never liked him. Well, what does that make you? I'm a good man. Everything I've done is to achieve good things. You guys just killed a whole bunch of cult cultists? He wouldn't say cultists. A whole <laughs> bunch of people with your actions here today. No. We didn't kill anybody. You guys did. And then I'm just gonna snap my finger. He's gone. Out of here. And then Duros just pipes. Well, technically, you just killed him. And the other. <laughs> <laughs> so you did actually kill somebody. And who? Oh, God. <laughs> I did what I had to do. I'm trying to be dramatic, Duros. I'm sorry. I'm I don't sorry. even care. About know. That's a technicality that I can't overlook. I've, I've seen so much corpse blood goo everywhere. I don't even care. I walk up over to that like like cryogenic chamber thing to see what was up with that. Like I look at Wait, that. You you look in there and you see the the body of um uh this like marine 
with he's sort of still in his like marine mm-hmm. clothes kind of uh and he's got ginger hair glasses i mean it looks like the would i recognize him from the photo i mean yeah. no the photo is of rain uh as oh, okay uh but you recognize him from the mech that you fought outside that was a right. mech version of him yeah. but this is the okay. original version I, um, there's a dude in here, guys. He looks like the guy we fought in the mech. I, uh, I, I honestly have no idea. I feel like if I mess with it, he might turn into a giant mechanical spider and kill us. <laughs> so I'm not, I'm not fucking touching this thing. I don't, I don't even, <laughs> you know, I mean, while we're I, ahead sort of situation. I don't know if we saved anything, but I guess we, we defeated I, them. I, I mean, we I really, the goal here was to rescue Trevor and Trevor, you have been rescued. Oh, congratulations, Trevor. <laughs> I mean, that wasn't the goal. That would just be, that was a side quest when, I mean, we came to this island to deal with this weird, wacky cult. And to be fair, we've now dealt with it. And William, you owe me a water award, so let's fucking go. I, I, I am very injured. Tell you what, I'll get a night, good night's sleep and then I'll fight you. All right, sounds like a fucking coward. But all okay. right, good. Listen, <laughs> we've, we've all been injured. All right, some of us can hold our blooded better than others, it seems. <laughs> Um, listen, I, I, Trevor, I see you're, you're this... You're literally bleeding all over the floor while you're saying that. Well, I see this as a total win. <laughs> I see this as a total success. Um, yeah. I will clean this up properly for the, uh, Marines. I get Jefferson oh, oh. arrested. Everest, Cyril's brother, arrested as well. Cyril sort of looks sad at that. My, not my brother. Um... Just give him a slap on the wrist, Trevor. He wasn't really that bad. Right. I mean, I don't know. I he's think he was mostly cold. just a yeah. victim of circumstance, honestly. Yeah, his girlfriend did throw a bunch of bombs at us, though. That oh, his know. girlfriend especially deserves death. Yo, fuck that. Arrest her. Okay, whoa, whoa, ease off the gas pedal, there, Hoss. Just <laughs> well, uh, and um, as a favor for you guys helping me out with this. I will leave your names off of all of this and you guys um, can just go back to your like little lovely lives. I mean, <sighs> William, why are you <laughs> even a pirate? Oh my God. I think, like, think it would be way more cool to say that like we fucked y'all mother up so that our bounties go higher and then we look even more badass. Yeah. I mean, can we, you get we, our... we you uh, want like, your bounties to be higher? I mean, yeah. it's pretty cool. I it's mean, a flex. Like, yeah, we got to flex somehow. We, I, mean, you, I want to be the strongest why, man in the world. You ask why I wanted to be a pirate? That's the reason why. So I can have like a giant bounty on my head and everyone in the world can fear me. That's, isn't that the whole reason we're all pirates, really? Well, I, I you're actually just want to fucking mental, mate. You're, out. you're mental. <laughs> You're the mental one. I thought we were coming to some how sort of my like, numbers are. I was kind of seeing where you guys were coming from in some areas, but the the shit you're that's coming out of your mouth right now is fucking mental, right? Listen, I I was gonna offer you something, but I don't think I want to anymore. Um, what were you gonna offer me? Well, it seems like you guys at least have some sort of good intention, and the Marines has have good use for pirates that can do what they're told. You were going to give us a marine battleship? That's awesome! You know, I, I, I fucking give... I, I give up. <laughs> I give up. I, I, I was going to offer you, William, since you guys killed the Timberlord, which I apologize, he was... I'm sorry that he ended up being a cultist. Yeah. Uh, I was going to offer you... I was going to... Well, I have to talk to the higher-ups, but offer you a position as a, as a warlord. Um... Oh, to replace him. Ooh, ooh, that sounds fancy. But I, I don't think like I want to anymore. <laughs> mm. Tell you what, how no, 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 tell you what, hold that thought. We'll have a, fu- we'll have, we'll have an exchange tomorrow, and whoever wins, I win. I get to be a warlord. You win. You could do whatever. How about we do that? I mean, I don't see but what I'm get getting to out of this. I get to decide the game. I get to decide the competition. All right, I don't see what I'm getting out of this. How about? <laughs> Um, <laughs> fuck, what do I even want? <laughs> oh, how about I win, I get my sword back? Okay. Oh. Oh. Wow. I, I'm super confident. I'm like, you know what? Okay. All right. I glance over at Verona and I wink. 
<laughs> I, I can see okay. you fucking winking, mate. Yeah. <laughs> Jarrell's glances over at Verona and winks too. <laughs> Everybody just winks. <laughs> hey, Pearl. You know, How Pearl just also winks. winks. Hey, I, do, I tried to wink with my eye patch up. <laughs> you guys hey, can't even see you me winking. can't wink back. see it, but Ragnar is also winking. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Healy, hey Healy, can you wink? I have not been programmed to wink, but I will ask Lissa to program me with winking capabilities. Yeah. Cool. If his eyes are just like light bulbs, I mean, just like click, click. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Now, yeah, this is an, a gentleman's agreement. I, yeah. I shake his hand. Gentleman, singular. He shakes your hand. Okay. All right. <laughs> How about tomorrow on the deck of the Yogi Poo the Second? At, I don't know, what time is it right now, Rustich? It's not, you know, your your ship is not the Yogi Fu the Second. It's the random Norse ship you got from Stalingrad. Crap, where's the Yogi Fu? In the Oasis. <laughs> oh, damn it, yeah, we have to get back there at some point. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, oh, man, it's yes, been a long, we, we, we got blasted into back, space, Captain. we killed a vampire, we killed V. I mean, a lot of shit's been going on, man. We went to uh, space. Okay, the Yogi Fu the Third. All right, and then... <laughs> Yeah, we're, so yeah. on the deck of our ship tomorrow, I don't know, 3 p.m., we're going to sleep in. I don't know. We could we could have a competition. Okay. Okay. Sweet. Um, well, I've got a busy day ahead of me of sorting all this shit out. So you guys yeah. go get your beauty sleep or whatever you need. Oh, um, damn straight we are. Oh, I'm going to hibernate. Okay, man, let's go take a nap. A nap for the ages. You guys heading back to the ship to take the nap? Yeah. Right. On yeah, my way yeah. out, I just grab one of those symbol cult things off of somebody's neck. I'm just like, eh, I could maybe use this for something later. Yeah. I'm a thief. I'm a disguise guy. It's what I do. I take uh, it. And I search my uncle for anything interesting. Mm. Yeah. yeah. You oh, you should go into his laboratory, dude. Hey, on the uh, way out. Duros will also go to the All Mother and see if she had anything else uh, and see if there's anything else on that paper. Was was that the only thing that was on the paper? Oh, on the piece of paper, it was a drawing of young, the old mother when she was a kid with a little message from Hastings. Just That's all that was on it. Okay. It's just a thing, right. a sentimental thing she keeps on her to keep her going through the rough times. Anyway. Duros also lifts the old mother up and he looks at Trevor. Can I also give her a proper burial? You could do whatever the fuck you want. I, I don't care. Um, Very well. I mean, we so can't I'll, throw I'll her, take, throw I'll her. take, yeah, I'll take, I'll take her, the swords and the weapons, so make sure no one yeah. else de good. desecrates her. Yeah. <laughs> Desecra yeah. All right. Uh, you're looking at uh, V Junior. Um, mm -hmm. You V Junior. You're looking through her, his pockets, um, and he just has like random shit, like spanners and nuts and bolts and stuff. But he does has, have like a wrapped up um, little letter on it. You, like, yeah, you pull it out. Do you reading it? Yes. <laughs> you read it, and it's all in code. Okay. It's all just, like, random, like, numbers and symbols and stuff that you do not understand. All right, I'll just pocket that for now. Yeah. What about the laboratory? Can we raid that, too? Yeah, sure, yeah, I guess you can. Just get raiding. Yeah. Um, just get plundering and looting like a bunch of old pirates you are. Well, We're actually doing suppose... pirate shit. We're actually <laughs> doing pirate shit. <laughs> What if Duros is holding the all mother while this is all going on? <laughs> well, as you're in yeah. the uh, laboratory, you do actually find the uh, Trevor's rune blade. Oh, oh, from oh, right. Staringrad. Oh, cool, cool. All right. Um, if you want to take that, uh, yeah, Tre Trevor's forgotten it about yeah. it. Um, I don't think get Trevor's my scimitar listening. back. Yeah, no, Trevor's like. Sorting, he's like he's on call to marine people and stuff, right? Mm. He's like yeah. he's doing he's doing business shit. I just um, walk in when he's doing business shit, and I'm just like, found your sword. Okay, later. Uh, <laughs> just walk out. <laughs> you just give it back. All right. Yeah, All right. I mean, it was just the sword we got from that island. Oh yeah, but it's like I motion like, hey, give back Verona's scimitar. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Sure. Fuck it. I'm gonna okay, get my actual you. sword tomorrow anyway. All right. yeah, yeah. Thanks. Um, you know, but no problem. when you're in the um, laboratory. Um, there are a bunch of like zombie corpses in here and you just see 
the corpse of a young girl with brown hair and glasses. Aww, sort of I kind of liked her. Wall. She was cool. Um, mm. Just laying there. Uh-huh. I don't remember her name. Well. Anybody a... remember her name? We probably never asked. <laughs> no, we probably she, never asked. She has yeah. a name tag on it that says. I checked, yeah, she has a name tag. Oh, Penny. 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 <laughs> Perry. P- Penny. Uh, Penny. There we go. <laughs> Penny. Blood on it. Sorry. Oh, there we go. Um, Duro size picks her up and puts her on. <laughs> I mean, the whole the place is covered of in women corpses. He's just carrying around. Well, she's a child, so he will take, obviously, the children, too. Though, as you guys are, are walking around uh, the cathedral, pretty much everyone's dead, except for one person who's barricaded themselves in the corner with a bunch of the pews and stuff. You can, oh, okay. he's, you could sort of see his eyes, and he's, he's still shivering there, scared. But everyone notices him, besides Ragnar, anyway, if you guys want to do anything about that. Um... Hello? Party's over, man. They're all dead. De- I mean, dead again. Deader. They're all deader. You know? You gotta bring them back? You zombie? Uh, you, no. You necromancers? No, I'm a William. And I'm a knight. And he's a bear. And he's a bear. And Verona's fucking cold-blooded as shit. But anyway. Um, <laughs> Thanks, Captain, I think. You're welcome. That's a, that's a, it was a compliment. It was a compliment. Where did, where did you guys come from? What are you guys um, doing? Look, we, we've just been through, like, literally hell. I mean, you, I'm just saying, look, battle's over. You want to come out? I mean, the church is yours now. Congrats. And in fact, I know I'll ordain you the leader of whatever the fuck cult this was. There you go. It was my home. My family. Well, it, I mean, it still can be. You just got to mop up all the corpses. Why did you kill everyone? They were well. We didn't kill the people in this room. To be fair, what they kind of we actually I don't we know. We only actually. killed two people. Yeah, we only killed two people. Exactly. Ah, you corrected the mistake from earlier, Verona. Very good. You, I, I saw the error of my <laughs> yeah. drama. Hero. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, it's very good. Very good. We didn't actually, kill. I actually don't have no idea what happened in this room. The all mother killed everyone. So, yeah. Well, the, if we want to be really technical, we were technically saving everybody. Yes. But it doesn't look like we murdered two to me. people. I, everyone is people. dead. Everyone. Well, that's just a matter of perspective. Yeah. Think about the thousands that could have been killed, but are now not dead. Are you going to kill me too? No. Can I move, can I move some of the things to even see who we're talking to right now? Like like a pew yeah. out of the way or whatever? Okay. You see a, a man with this like bright white hair. Um, okay. He's got like a headband on as well, and he's got the t- typical cult clothing. All right. Um, and he looks. White like... hair. Oh, crap. Wait a second. Verona, this might no, be another. Not a relative. <laughs> okay. No, just, no, I just want to make sure. One with white Maybe to just silver old. hair is my relative. Yeah. <laughs> um, I hope. Wait, Captain, stand back. He's old. The peculiar thing about this guy <laughs> is he has uh, one blue eye, one orange eye. What is that called? Uh, it's like, oh, heterochromia, heterochromia. He's got heterochromia. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and somebody yeah, correct his, me if I'm wrong, his but I think it's that. And he's sort of, he's got little puppets next to him. Um, I, th- okay. Are you going to kill me? No, dear friend. No, you are, you're free now. You're fine. That's, that's good. Can I leave? Yeah, sure. Do whatever you want. Yeah. He nods his head. Okay. And he stands up. He picks up some of his little puppets. Oh, okay, he had puppets. And he, he, yeah, I just wrote. And he walks, he slowly starts to walk out. And he just leaves. Just okay. like that. I, um, I'm going to be I'm real gonna... with you, Captain. Um, he survived a giant zombie apocalypse in here. And he looks just fine without a scratch on him. Yep. I mean, he was barricaded. That might have been corner. a bad thing. Do you want to kill him? No. <laughs> There's been enough death. I tell you what, tell you what. You know what? That just means, tell you what, let's say he leaves here today and he becomes our enemy further down the line. That's just another adventure for the Devil's Look Pirates, right? God, no, I we don't know anything about him, so there really is no point in trying to. I mean, to. William says that, but he's coked in blood. I am covered in blood. I am dissolved. I am very tired. Um, 
I think we should just head back to the ship, honestly, if we have everything here we need, you know? Oh, Trevor's nice. going to take right. care of everything, I guess. You guys head back to the ship. I guess. Okay. Uh, Duros, can I help yes? you bury them on the way? Uh, of course, friend. I would be on it. <laughs> All right, that's very sweet. Aww. You guys are burying stuff as you guys leave. Yes. Um, give a little funeral service. Yes. And Just try to give the good ones a, a proper <laughs> burial. I don't know if we found that other friend that was in the place. I forgot his name. We just knocked him out. He's probably dead. He's probably dead. Oh, the Nathaniel <laughs> guy? No, you yeah, were yeah. Nathaniel. I was Nathaniel, like Can't my friend, his name. The, Jeremy or whatever. Jeremiah. I yeah, yeah Jeremiah. Dead. All right. Imagine, imagine yeah, he slept through dead. it all. He slept through it all. You walk <laughs> through the town covered in blood. I mean, you've already killed the police, so they're not uh, coming after you. I don't care. Um, Anybody right. wants to mess with us? <laughs> I mean... But you... you yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You hear Trevor over the phone, uh, over the his little Den Den Mushy to the Marine mm -hmm. base. He's like yelling and stuff, and he's like, "Yes, yes, um, yes, yeah." They were uh, Jefferson said there were um, four brothers: him, V, Arzen, and um, um, he. Let me get back to you on that, William. He yells yes. out, "Yes." Did you guys you kill a, um, a another brother? Uh, let's see. Was the Timberlord a brother? Uh, no, he was a cousin. Okay. Uh, <laughs> like, um, let's see. We killed this dude uh, that controlled bugs. I think he was just a cousin. He was a cousin, too. too. He was a cousin. All right. Guys, who else did we kill? All right. There was a lot of dead people in that building. Okay, we've killed... Okay, strongest people we've killed. We've killed Arzen, we killed Duros, we killed... Wait, hey! B, <laughs> oh, we yeah. killed... Other Duros, yes. Yeah, oh, yeah, other Duros, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah I, don't, I don't think we've killed anybody. Like, would he, if he would have been ridiculously strong, like as strong as, like, uh, Arzen, we haven't killed anybody else, like, that strong in a while. Well, yeah. um... Ah, oh, shit. Fuck, well... And then he goes back to reporting. Oh, did one of them get away? It, it doesn't seem we, we don't have the identification of the fourth brother, but Shit. I'm sure they probably. Uh, and then he goes, I'm sure they probably died in the cathedral or something, right? Um, it was a bloodbath in there. I William can't imagine drops anyone surviving. his sword and, and proceeds to scream "fuck" at the loudest as he can <laughs> to the sky. <laughs> and then Trevor continues to go. Um, and honestly, if there was anyone left in that building, I would have personally taken care of them. So. <laughs> Oh, Jefferson. Yeah, it wasn't Jefferson, right? Jefferson was yeah. one of the four. Jefferson, right, so Oz, and V. Right, yeah. And then with yeah. three of them. I thought the all mother was, well, I guess she would have been. Yeah, the yeah, mother. She, wasn't a, she was a mother. She wasn't a brother. Okay. okay. All right, then. Well, we have a problem. So you guys head back to the ship. <laughs> and Gravy put. You, Gravy's already got food. a full feast out. Oh, jeez. Thank you, Gravy. Oh. Uh, so <laughs> Uh, this is going to be a weird request, Gravy, but do you happen to have any gummy bears? Oh, I yes. Mean, I have I've been so craving many. them all day for some oh, reason. I have made these myself. My I blood sugar's very bears. low right now. Oh, oh wow. Man. You know, I'm, Fantastic. A, I'm a big gummy bear boy. <laughs> um, He starts throwing the gummy bears out at everyone. Lissa yeah. sees you guys covered in blood. And Lissa, like, yeah. runs up and, like, grabs Verona's arm and she's like, are you, if you could change your face, if, uh, are you okay? Are you alright? There's so much blood, are you alright? What happened? Is a... Uh, what's going on? Did you did we, you kill her? We took care of the problem, yeah. Are you but okay? I'll be okay tomorrow. Do you need some water? Water? You need some water? No, I think I'm just gonna go lay down, actually. It's been a long, long day. Okay. I've had enough. <laughs> I'm so I'm just going to walk past everybody and just go, collapse. Go yeah. <laughs> collapse in a I'm bed. I'm going to go take a shower and oh probably god. pass out in the shower. Oh god. Ugh. I'm going to walk. Fish. Go ahead. <laughs> just move. Any, right. Gravy, Gravy, Lissa, do me a favor. Anybody shows up on the ship uninvited, just kill them. I don't even care. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to go. <laughs> well, uh, Gravy said, oh, speaking of uninvited guests, um, those two fellows woke up while she were gone. Oh, right, yeah, how did they handle that? Well, they seemed nice enough. I let them leave. 
You know what? I don't even care. Is Sarah's older brother? He seemed friendly. Yeah, yeah, fine. They yeah. there was way worse out there than just them. You know, I was a little peeved off at his girlfriend, but whatever, it's <laughs> fine. All all's on water under the bridge she at this a... point. Literally. <laughs> She was a magician. She showed me some tricks. Reminds me of you. Aww. I think you would have been good friends with her. Oh, yeah, I probably would have. She didn't. She really enjoyed my croissants. Rap. That's oh. good. Nice. Uh, Louis, you do make some damn fine croissants, well, gravy. All thanks to Louis, he showed me how to make them. Yep. Oui, oui, that's, that is true. It's the only thing I know how to make is croissants. I'm glad. But you. Oh, you. but. <laughs> By the way, Gravy, completely unrelated, but I happened to be in your room a couple while a while back, and I found this cool picture of you and all of the flames, and you had this awesome boar outfit on. You should wear that more often, dude. No, I don't. That is not me anymore. Uh, okay. Oh. Well, it looked cool. It did, and you can buy it on Rusted. Uh, <laughs> You could buy that poster. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, no. Uh, I think it's teespring.com slash store slash rustage. Yeah. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> yep. It was like, well, I just got an advertisement, but that's weird. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, <laughs> we, all, we all have to break the fourth wall every once in a while. Okay. Uh, yes, yes. All right, anyway. Um, yeah, I'm just, I, I'm, I'm going to sleep. So, you know. You don't want any of this food? I thought you guys we, no, would we be ate. happier. We, we no, ate it. I, I was going to yeah. say, Ragnar walks up to, like, one set part of the table, and, like, in, in, and in one piece fashion, it just, like, he, like, leans towards it, and it just, like, a bunch of it disappears, and he goes <laughs> he goes to the corner and just, like, leans against the wall and slowly, like, falls down and falls asleep. <laughs> <laughs> Pearl is eating too, but everyone seems kind of in a bummer mood as they're just sort of eating yeah. their food, lying down. It's a really interesting sort of end to an arc where everyone's just really depressed about the things that happened. Yeah. Um, you don't get this in One Piece. Killed a lot of people, got guamped by corpses. No, I'm pretty sure there was a depressed part. Oh, there was. There were many I depressed remember. parts in One Piece. <laughs> oh, God, yeah. I just mean not yeah. after the, the crew succeed. Yeah, usually like, <laughs> you know. Um, so they all, everyone sort of lays down and goes to sleep for the night. Oh God. Feels like I haven't had a full night's sleep since like June. <laughs> Yo, Ragnar dreams about the fact that if he he used his third attack on the All Mother, like he could have, but forgot that he has a third attack, he we probably could have knocked her out unconsciously. <laughs> oh my God, or, Ragnar uh, kills another one. Not lethally. <laughs> I attacked her twice, but I could have done three I don't times. Know why light went off. Oh, Ragnar right. kills again. Is that the name of the episode? Ragnar <laughs> slays again. We should put the animated dagger as the uh, yeah, as the thumbnail. Uh, How much HP did she have on that last hit? 14? She had 12. She didn't have 14, uh, but it was close. Not, nah, See, close I would have killed her if I shot her first for the record. All right. Yeah. All, all right. right all well, right. you know. All right. All right. Hey, you had to do what you had to do, man. I tried. I thought she was weaker, so I attempted. Yeah. But no, anyway, even I, more I so, sleep. the sword could have knocked her out. Yeah. <laughs> The sword could have knocked her out. Uh, thanks, Ragnar. Uh. <laughs> oh. oh, God, it's so good to get a heal in. Holy shit. Everyone full rests. It's a full oh, rest. God. That was a meat grinder, Rustage. How many battles Holy was that? Fuck. Holy crap. I that mean, was like that's since what... we got to the island, we fought, um, what was, what was his name, Crispin? Wait, no. Crispin? Who the fuck is Crispin? <laughs> <laughs> Who is this or man that you've invented? We fought Everest, right? <laughs> that Everest. is nowhere like, near yeah, Everest, though. <laughs> Crispin? I don't yeah. know why that was the first name that came to my mind. I Crispin don't know who Freeman, that is, but he's going to exist in the future for sure. <laughs> Crispin Freeman is the VA that plays Alucard in Helsing. I don't know why his name popped into my head just now. Fucking Crispin? But okay, it's Crispin then. All right, we fought against Crispin. No, you fought against and, uh, Phelan <laughs> and Everest. And Arzen, and Everest, Bi Bio Arzen, then the machines, yeah, and then uh, the All Mother, Jam, and yeah, Jam, Jam, Sorry, Jam then the All Mother, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't know if they counted, but um, but yeah, and in the Crispin All Mother, is the fourth fight, brother. <laughs> in the All Mother fight, we had a bunch of corpses, four mm. fucking sea five. kings, five, five sea kings. Oh my god! Now that's a lot of XP. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But you leveled up halfway through. Yes. You're not quite in the next level yet. We're not there yet. But... That's fine. We leveled up halfway through all that bullshit, so it's great. Yeah. No, it wasn't bullshit. It was really cool. It's just, man, that was a that was a boss gauntlet if there ever was one. Holy shit. Yeah. Well. 
Oh. <laughs> All right, that was. <laughs> now what the hell do we do? With our lives? I guess rest. we got to find our ship. Well, we you wake it. up on... to a knock on your door. Oh, oh God, it's early. What? Hello. You challenge. We're, we're, we're gonna fight. It's fucking Trevor, oh, shit. of course. Is it, is it three o'clock oh. already? Yeah, it's Damn fucking it. right, it's Trevor. All right. Well, I got right. business about... need to do, so let's do this now. All right, come on. All right. <laughs> You're now standing on the bow of the ship with um, with Trevor. I'm kind of pissed. I was gonna like ask Dur I was ask Verona and Lissa to whip me up some like like to booby trap the deck or whatever. Yeah, but I well. slept through the whole thing, so I'm like shit. All, All right, right. Um, what is your um, duel of choice, brother? One round of poker. <laughs> poker. You son of a bitch. You little... St you... Why don't I even let I you have... choose? Why the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you don't want poker, I have another idea. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> what, what is your other idea? Um, you know, it's just, uh, well, we, you have a sword, right? You have your rune sword, right? Well, no, I have... you guys fucking took it. No, I gave it to you. I gave, oh, you gave back it back. To you. Oh shit! Thank you. Yeah, I have yeah, it in my hand. I took. I gave that back to you, and I took back Verona's scimitar and gave it back to him. Sorry, so, I, we all have it. so you have the. You have a sword. I have a sword. Yeah. I just like. How about we fight? First person to drop their sword loses. Drop that. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. So let's just you stand over there. I'll stand over here. We count to three, and we begin right. fighting. I guess. Do you, uh, do you, you both stand in place. Okay. With your swords drawn. You're gonna regret right. this, William. I put my no, hand I okay. put my hand in my bag as we begin the duel. Duros, count down, oh. please. Wait oh, oh sure, yes, of course. Uh three, two, one, begin! I push the button of the device that Lissa and Verona made for me, which was an explosive that I hid in the hilt of Ah, oh, fuck my sword. Okay. <laughs> Shit. So you I really did <laughs> <laughs> what you did <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh my god. So fuck, I did not think that through. <laughs> So your sword blows up in your face. No, 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 no. It's not the whole thing, just the... All right, I'm not going to do that, obviously. <laughs> All right, well, I did say I was going to do it. Fuck. All right, so... I mean, you dropped your weapon, bit. dude. Yeah, I dropped my weapon, dude. Shit. All right, well, the sword's destroyed, though. So, Well, it's like the hilt is, anyway. Oh, so he can't Fuck. even get his sword back. Well, no, he can. It's just the, the, the hilt is broken. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay, so backstory on that. A little bit. William. So I thought it'd be a cool idea back when we were on Duros, when we had Lissa recruited. I'm like, okay, I'm going to have her make me a device. Basically, it was like a C4 charge. And uh, Verona worked on that a little bit. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to have that on my sword handle. And if, you know, what's it, Trevor ever steals it or whatever, then I could just detonate it and blow up it up in his hand. And I was like, man, I can't wait to use that. And I'm mm -hmm. like, oh, this is the perfect time to use that. And then I remember. <laughs> I didn't fucking hand him my sword. <laughs> oh my god. Trevor... It's not broken, though. The sword isn't, yeah. like, I, I made it designed so it doesn't destroy the blade. You just have to replace the handle, but... You look up yeah. at Trevor. Like, pfft. You look up at... <laughs> you look up at Trevor looking at you. And he smiles slightly. <laughs> and he, he sheaths his sword away, and he walks up to you and puts his hand on your shoulder. I didn't lose my hand, no. It wasn't that strong. Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You just yeah. dropped the sword. Yeah. Uh, just he put, he puts was... his hand on your shoulder and goes, Never change, William. Never <laughs> change. And then he just leaves. Oh, okay. He can see that his okay. sword is like on the ground. And he just leaves. All right. Um. <clears throat> Fuck. My God, William, you're so smart. <laughs> you, yes, right. that was my plan. You, so, you somehow managed to keep your, your sword without fighting him. Yeah, and sure it did. Now it's that was such things. a brilliant play, Captain. <laughs> yeah, blood diffusing the entire situation and leaving him in a good mood. <laughs> yep, I, I probably took. I mean, I did take. I mean, there was an explosive in my hand, but you know, it wasn't enough to like blow my hand off. But like, you know, I thought shit. the explosive was stronger than that. I guess I screwed up. <laughs> <laughs> One would that say that was such... pretty five head. 
That is so perfect, though, for the way that ended up. Like, I seriously, that wasn't me doing that on purpose. I just literally fucking forgot about what I was doing there, which is a very William thing to do. Um, All right, we could fix that handle and we'll be good. Maybe don't put explosives in it next he time. Stand, as he stands on the dock, he uh, he just sort of looks back and he goes, William. Oh, yeah, Louie, reverse it, please. There you go. That solves the <laughs> problem. He, he, stand, he stands on the dock and he okay. looks back at you and he goes, William... Um, I don't think I actually said this before, but, um, uh, thank you, by the way. <gasps> um, you, you're welcome, brother. Next time I see you, you are still a wanted criminal, mm -hmm. and I will be taking you in, so. All right. I wouldn't have it any other way, bro. Well, I think you would actually, but uh. yeah, probably. But I'm trying to, I'm trying to, trying to salvage what little cool factor I have right now. So, oh, you know. yeah. oh don't Louis, worry, that's completely gone, Captain. Don't you Louis, worry. Please refer, reverse <laughs> my hand, please. <laughs> uh, this seems like uh, okay. Sure, fuck it. <laughs> All right, cool. And and fix the sword. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Okay. Cool. Um, we'll try that again, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> you know, <laughs> no, he just now that it's a new day. Yeah, morale's yeah. at an all-time high. Yeah, <laughs> Louis, how the heck are you related to a scimitar? It is very complicated. <laughs> so in my um, oh yes, yes, it is. Some people have said it's because of my sharp personality. Uh, I I have a um, it is. Listen. How the fuck are you related to a to a genocidal maniac? <laughs> <laughs> you got me there. Well, I, was, I wasn't expecting that answer, but yeah, all right. <laughs> Just kind of goes brood in the corner. Thanks. <laughs> no, uh, Corona, do you have any family left, by the way, that we should know about? Wait, <laughs> I, uh, probably. <laughs> probably. Oh. There's probably somebody somewhere that'll be your your second cousin twice removed or some mm -hmm. shit. You know, we'll I didn't find. even know my mother had family, but here we are. <laughs> As it Mothers. happens, you know. Oh no! I mean, I All do right. have a cousin on my father's side somewhere. Yep. <laughs> uh, I wouldn't have the end of this arc any other way, guys. <laughs> <laughs> and Trevor's like, guys, get the fuck out of here before before the Marines arrive. I'm oh, being generous. Oh. Epic story ends with me, William, blown his own goddamn hand off. Okay, let's, <laughs> let's just go. Let's get out of here. Let's find our ship. Set sail to new adventure. Are you guys going to the Oasis or back to Stalingrad? Uh, where was Boss saying he was going? He said, meet me at Stalingrad, right? No, you said he was always at the Oasis, but you <laughs> yeah. sent a letter. We, for him to, to meet us at Stalingrad. To, to hit, for him okay, to so it probably would be at Stalingrad. Let's head so, there then. I mean, it's on yeah, route okay. anyway. Yeah, it's on route. Oh, okay. yeah, I figured the Oasis would be further. Yes. But yes. yes. Yeah. Yeah, okay, so let's head back to Stalingrad to see if he's there. And uh, if not, hit up the Oasis, I guess. Yep. Um, and you guys set sail into what the sea. The port. Okay. This is my ship noises. I hope you like them. Whee! We're going so fast! <laughs> Nothing can stop us now. It's the. I mean, Except it's like a, the following day. It's the day you've set forth. Um, Lissa. Yeah, I mean, does everyone wave to Trevor? <laughs> Bye, Trevor. Bye. He sort of nods his head as the ship has it. Anytime. Needs. Do yeah. I still have the Den Den Mushy he gave me? I still have that, right? Probably, yeah. Yeah, okay. I can right. call him whenever. Yeah. <laughs> you can call him, beep him if you want to reach him. Yeah, if you want to reach um, him. Trevor Possible. So. Lissa goes up to Verona and sort of looks up into his goggles and says, um, is everything okay? Um, yeah. What happened back there? Well, it turns out the person that was causing us all so much trouble was actually in need of help herself, That's but we terrible. weren't able to do it. That's terrible. It's not your fault, you know that? Yeah, but I did also have to kill my uncle, so that... Uh, but you... You know, it's uh, all in a... I mean... All in a week, uh... Yeah. Um... If you ever need to talk or anything about anything, I realize that 
I feel like you haven't ha really had the opportunity to talk things out that much. I I'll I'm here for you, remember? I always remember. And I'm here for you as well. And I touch her on the shoulder. Uh, well, thank you. I mean, I appreciate that. I made you a present whilst you were gone. Oh. Uh, well, what's that? Much of a, Aww. Uh, a tailor. Um, Gravy helped me a little bit, but I made you this jacket. Oh. Wow. Yeah, it's. Um, no one's. It's got some little hidden tricks and stuff um, that I think you'll find very exciting. Hmm. Slip that on. Does I it have pockets? Have... <laughs> it definitely has pockets. So what can it? What can it do? I mean, thank you, Lissa. Well, she she winks and goes. Won't it be a little bit more fun to find out yourself? I suppose you're right. I take off the sleeveless coat I was wearing before, which. Mm -hmm for those who don't know, did used to be my father's. And I'm just gonna drop it into the sea. Aww. Oh. See, that's an emotional, like, thing ending to this arc. That's way more symbolic and shit. <laughs> um, and shit. And shit. <laughs> and shit. And shit. <laughs> and shit. And shit. Um, and shit. Is there anything oh. that you guys want to say to each other as you're sailing? Before you get to Sterengrad. We do have we do have like fifty more minutes, so Yeah, we can do uh, that. Um William. See. Yeah. Would you have wanted to become a warlord? I mean, uh. like, it would have been cool. I think I hear through the grapevine that if you become a warlord, you basically like you work for the government, but that also means the Marines don't chase after you anymore, so that's really sweet. You know? Mm. I'm yeah, not I, very full so of actually. I so do not want to work dogs. on the Navy. Yes. I mean, I guess we would be viewed as like government dogs from like other pirates, which that would have sucked. I mean, a lot of other pirate crews don't tend to like us anyway, though. So, I mean, mm. yeah. I mean, I don't, want, I don't want, I don't want to follow the Navy. So, I think it was a good call. Also, maybe, maybe someday. Our bounties What's get frozen, right? So, I want to. Yeah, I wanna yo, have yeah, big... that's right. We don't even that's have boring. bounties anymore. That sucks. Like that part. You know, I can't wait to get the paper and find out how the you know where we're at right now. But wait, oh wait, he said he was going to leave us off. Yeah, Is there anything we're not we... actually getting any credit, Captain. I, I well, we still give me credit. I want fucking yeah, credit. Yeah, I want the credit, damn it. Yeah. <laughs> I think we he still took out those guys. guys. We took out that rubber guy. Maybe maybe our bounties will go up from, from him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he was oh. quite a formidable foe. Huh? <laughs> uh, yes, of course. You and Trevor should have done a Davy back fight. Oh man, maybe next time. Next time when I ne we will duel, and next time I won't blow my fucking hand off. There we go. That'll be a good one. Uh, at least You'll I'll try not to blow off, my man. hand off. <laughs> because I'm assuming that like, the explosive actually did blow my hand off, and just Louis could repair it. You know. Well, he wouldn't have been able to repair it. I think if it actually came off. But okay, it, it just really just like yeah. It was really messed up. And yeah, then, yeah, yeah. yeah. Question though, if he repaired the sword, did the explosive go back in the store? Yes, yeah, yes, yeah, it, yeah, it did. Yeah. Okay, so it's reloaded. I could do that again. Just try not to blow my own hand off next yeah. time. Okay, hey, listen, cool. do you want to up the explosives in that thing this time? <laughs> I, they're a little weak. <laughs> they didn't even blow off his hand. <laughs> I mean, I could do my best. I just thought, um, all right. Huh? I just look at the chat and it's just like the chat is so horny. Like someone just said <laughs> that. You know? like, you got a very horny chat. Yeah. Why? Um. Nobody here is as haughty as you guys in the chat. <laughs> These guys, they're all respectful, respectful gentlemen. Um. Do we need the horny? That's police? right. I, um, I've never done anything bad in this story. I, get the horny yeah. police out here. Yeah. Never yeah. done anything. Duros never. Yeah. You know, Don't make me kuma bonk you. I will. Here's a question, William. I, I I stand in front of everybody. I'm like, okay, guys. You know, we've had a. We've had a lot of crazy weeks last, you know, space and then got back and then we got rushed into this cult thing. Like we kind of have our own, uh, you, we're kind of like, you know, we're, we're done with everything. Like, what do you guys want to do next? What, what, what should we do? Have any ideas? Well, I would like to actually uh, protect something for once <laughs> instead of destroying an entire place and society we and leaving <laughs> the Navy to pick up after our own mess. That I would like yeah. to do something good. Yes. Okay, something good. Hmm. We could no. Wait, that would kill a lot of people. Um, oh. <laughs> like William's just like, well, oh. shit. 
<laughs> Come for another adventure, no matter. We could, the ad difficulty. We could adopt a dog. A dog. <laughs> you could protect the dog. We could have a dog. We could have a little companion. Well, technically, we have a bear, and I protect the bear. We uh -huh. also have a dragon. <laughs> <laughs> I also protect the dragon still. I'll tell you what, I really want to go to that sea gym place. I want, I want to see Blake oh, again. Same! Yeah, I want to go there. We can but go we, there. Pearl pipes up, but we don't know where it is. Only Blake knows where it is. Oh, well, we, have the the we have the talkie walkies. True. <laughs> we have the candles. We can still Wait, try to find them. Do you want a talkie walkie? Do you want to try it out? Okay. Yeah, talkie walkie. All right. Give it a shot. <laughs> um... Uh, come in, people. Blake, anybody there? <laughs> oh, hello, darling. I forgot about this thing. You hear Hemlock's voice from the other side. Oh, Hemlock, how you doing? Doing absolutely splendid, my dear. How are you lot doing? Great. We just killed a lot, a lot of people, but we liberated uh, a town from a cult. So there we go. The course for the Devil's Luck Pirates, right? Yeah. Well, they were mostly corpses, but yeah. Mm -hmm. Fair um, enough. Anyway, are you guys still at the uh, the sea gym place? No, we went to the Oasis like you. We said we were going to. Oh, that, um, well, then Blake said he was going to go to the sea gym. So I just. Oh, uh, Blake can wait, honey. There's something more important going down here. Um, Ooh. There's actually a it's. Great that you called. There's a man here who wants to talk to you. Yeah, I wanted um, to ask, actually, is Boss still there? Yes, Giant yes. guy, leopards, you know, well, tiger pattern, you know, him you, horn on his head. We yeah. got your letter, but Boss is still yeah. here. He sent cool. out a letter to um, Sterengrad to say that you guys um, should just come straight and meet us at the Oasis. Um, okay. Oh. Well, then. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Do you want to talk to, to you, us? I mean, I honestly, I completely forgot that we had these things. <laughs> yeah, honestly, we did too. They probably would have oh, maybe is... come in. They would have uh -huh. maybe come in handy because we might have needed your help at some point. There, we almost died several times, but we managed to th get through. Persevere. I blew off my yeah. hand at one point, but we're good. Um, all right. So yeah, we'll just head to the oasis then. That's cool. We can meet up with Roulette. Maybe uh, you know. Yeah, so nice. you, 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 the, the phone gets sort of grabbed out of, out of the hand and goes, "Hello, is this?" William D. Chapston? You can try to recognize the voice. No. Is this, is this... You do not oh, recognize okay. the voice. All right. I was like, uh, he, yes. Ah. Hello. My name is Dane Goodman, and I have a deal for you. <laughs> and Hemlock's in the background, like, hey, give that back. She sort of snatches the phone out of their hands. Sorry, that's the man that I was talking about. He, um, um. Well, what was the deal? I mean, I could give it back if you want. Nah, it's fine. I'll see him when we get there. Sure. <laughs> hey, I have the phone. I have it for a second. Sure. Oh, yeah. I toss it to I toss it to Ragnar. <laughs> hey, I'm Locke. I'm hello. Ragnar. I'm a bear. Uh, darling. Hello. How are you doing? How's how's your voice? Seems a little different. Oh, nice and fluffy. It got, a little, it got soaked in blood, but then I, I I jumped in the water and got saved by got saved by uh who can swim. Um. I don't think anyone on your crew could really swim. Duro's can, but he's, he has Duro to be save he's covered me. Duro in armor. Save me. I took, I took a nice <laughs> bath, and now my, my fur is nice and soft and fluffy. Ooh. That's very nice. Well, no, oh. I'm, I'm very happy for you, Ragnar. Is, is there a sea gym on the Oasis? It is not on the Oasis, my dear, but we can get you to the sea gym soon enough. All right, sounds good. Tosses All the phone right. back to William. <laughs> Thank you. And oh, by the way, Ragnar, I would probably, by process of elimination, it would probably be Lissa that would probably be the best swimmer in our crew. Mm. And I would just imagine. Yeah. yeah. Her or gravy. I, yeah, I was thinking I gravy too. I didn't actually learn how to swim because we didn't have, uh, we, we had like swimming the weird, pools on well, Duros. Cyril can literally well, just pull you out of the water. It, it wasn't possible yeah. to swim on it because it's like really oh. thick and viscousy. Ew. What did you drink? Um, we, we got all our water from the ground. Oh, okay. Oh, what? Weird. <laughs> All right. Well, anyway, um, yeah, Duros. I mean, he could always fish you out of the water too with like fishing yes, equipment. Yes, and Duros. Yeah. yeah. I mean, and that's Cyril. We we we're set. All right. Yeah. So uh, we'll just plot a course toward the oasis, bro, and a plot a course toward the oasis because I'm assuming you can just do that. I think we have an internal post. <laughs> I think right? we. I think we have it. Yeah. Yes. I... Sure. We can get there. Uh, we'll we'll get oh, yeah, there right. at some point in the future. All we'll, right. We'll we'll throw a party, my dears. 
will rendezvous soon. Yeah. You seem a lot. Your voice seems to have changed a bit since last time. Well, that's that's not right. <laughs> is this not how I've already sounded? What is different um, about my voice now? It must be the the, the Dendan Mushi. Yeah. yeah, it's just the Dendan Mushi. It's the connect. Well, the talkie walkie. The, talkie -walkie. Yeah, the, the, the connection is a little spotty. Maybe okay. I need to go back and listen to my own voice again. I just don't remember you saying darling as much, but I well, think that I'm might just of, be I'm my a, spotty memory. I'm in a better mood, darling. <laughs> then, then again, I don't remember half <laughs> the stuff that we've done anyway, so, you know. <laughs> I mean, I... <laughs> I keep thinking I've killed little Timmy, and I don't think that was the case, or something. I don't know. Well, um, right. Uh, we'll be there soon. I, I'll, I'll tell Dane that you'll be here soon. He's very excited to meet you guys. Um, mm. Um, I'm sure he is. We are we are rather famous. <laughs> yes, we really are. Well, toodaloo. All right, it, but, William out. Okay, cool. All right, so we're going to the Oasis. Return to the Oasis arc. There we go. <laughs> well, there you go. Then we could do it to be continued. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, I was like, like setting up for like, what's the perfect spot Bam, to be continued. Bruh. <laughs>